it was Achilles. I know the chariot, I know the shield, I know the insignia of his father's house. It was Achilles. I knew him and he knew me. Though two armies rode between us. But he was coy or clever. Rode just behind the lines, just where I could see him, but I couldn't get at him. I went after him. A man tried to bar my way. I spit at him with my spear and flung it behind me. Another tried to climb aboard my chariot. I split his head open with my sword, but still he kept his distance, riding away just behind the lines, taunting me. I was in a fury. I redoubled my attack, killing, crushing. I hardly knew what I was doing anymore. I only wanted to get at him. And suddenly, I did. I was there. And on the open field, there was just him and me. This seemed to startle him. He lost his nerve or something, made one turn too many or too sharp and was flung from his chariot. I hurled myself after him, grappled him right there on the ground. His sword came up and slammed against my head, stunned me. And in just that moment, he got the better of me. He reared up over me, raised his spear for the final thrust. But he was careless. He raised his arms too high. I thrust up with my sword and caught him just under the chin, slicing through the jaw and the tongue and the brain. His blood rained down and blinded me and I rode free as he toppled in the mud. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I got him at last. Achilles, the pride and terror of the Greeks. It seemed too simple. I went to him. I went to claim his helmet from a trophy. I tore it off. It was... It was... It was not Achilles. It was... Patroclus. Yes, Patroclus. He'd sent the boy, his lover, out dressed in his own armour. Why? To tease me, bait me, draw me on. Why? Why?